If you've been using the internet for, say, the last five years or so, then you've probably come across a few life hack videos explaining how to set up habits which will help you win the day. Probably the most overused idea I see all over the internet is the huge wake up at 4 a.m. craze. Now, before I get any hate mail, please note that I'm not saying this is a dumb idea inherently. Many people have found a vast amount of success in starting their mornings very early, and I'm certainly not qualified to attempt to discredit those testimonies. If it works for you, that's great and you should definitely do it. However, I think the message lacks a bit of nuance. If you're waking up at 4am, then you're probably having to go to sleep very early as well in order to get enough rest, which isn't necessarily being communicated all that well. Aside from that, there's no secret that you unlock by waking up that early. Again, it may work for some, but we certainly don't have to do that if we want to be successful. What we need are not ultra-specific rules, but rather guidelines. Here's five steps I've recently taken which has enhanced my morning routine. Number one, I schedule my day the night before. I found that scheduling or time blocking my day into distinct segments has allowed me to become far more productive. Even more so, far more intentional, which I believe is just as important. If you take a few moments each day to reflect on tomorrow and decide on specifically what you want to accomplish, it will allow you to construct your schedule in much more meaningful ways. Setting a schedule takes a stress of spontaneity off of your shoulders. You don't have to think about what to do. You've already taken the time to step back and think about the most important things which you need to complete, and now all you have to do is do it. Number two, wake up at the same time every day. Now before you get defensive, this doesn't necessarily have to include the weekend. However, if you're trying to get this habit to stick early on, it's certainly not a bad idea. Nonetheless, setting this normality in your sleeping schedule reinforces your circadian rhythm, aka your 24-hour biological clock. This sets normalcy in your everyday routine and more importantly gives you the best chance to get the best sleep of your life. I adopted this habit this year and it has significantly impacted my sleeping schedule as well as how rested I feel in the morning. Number three, establish your morning wins. What are the two, five, or nine things that are under your control every morning that you would feel great about accomplishing? They can be as simple as just making your bed or doing laundry. You can devote time to developing physically in the gym, mentally through meditation or reading, or whatever it is that makes a positive impact in your life. How many times have you felt like your day was ruined before it even started? I'd be willing to bet that you didn't give yourself ample time to wake up, exercise physically and mentally, eat a healthy breakfast, and prepare for the day. Yes, it's easier said than done, but we have to crawl before we can walk and run. What are the two to three things you can implement into your morning routine which help you jumpstart your day? Number four, develop a vitamin and supplement regimen. No, you do not need to spend $200 on protein powder every month. Truth be told, you can survive off of absolutely zero supplements if your diet is good enough. Eating whole, organic foods filled with nutrients is always the best way to stay healthy and makes for an amazing breakfast. However, many of us simply do not maintain a diet that receives the necessary vitamins, minerals, essential fatty acids, etc. necessary for our bodies to be functioning at optimal levels. This is where having a limited number of natural supplements in your daily routine comes into play. Number five, and maybe the most simple one, drink water. No, I'm not your mother, but science tells us that each morning your body wakes up slightly dehydrated. Rachel Lapidos of Well and Good recently interviewed Paula Simpson, who is a holistic beauty nutritionist, about this very topic. Paula said that drinking water in the morning rehydrates your body, allows for better digestion, helps to fuel your morning workout, and famously hydrates your skin. As much as we coffee lovers hate it, it's best to stick to water upon waking up. This allows our bodies to wake up, hydrate, and get going before we flood our system with caffeine. Again, easier said than done, but we're trying to get five minutes better today, remember? Developing an excellent morning routine could be exactly what you need to propel your personal life or career to a new level. Just by developing a few small habits each morning that are conducive to your success, you can win your morning and your day.